Good morning, folks. Jason Cressman here, Grazing Acres Farm. It's first thing in the morning, and I came up this morning to do my farm chores, and I've already noticed I made a mistake last night. When I was closing up the chickens last night, evidently I missed one, because when I was uh, giving them their water and food this morning, one come to visit me before I had even released the chickens. So she must have hit underneath the coop all night, and I'm glad she's all right. I uh, made it back to the cattle now, and as you can see, we've got our first snow overnight. Cattle are out here grazing. Um, seem to be pretty content. I'm going to go feed them a bale here in a second, and reeting up in the next pasture, clear up in that corner. Um, two days ago, I had 24 more round bales delivered. And yesterday I spent uh, some of my time moving those bales and placing them up in this pasture. I've got a poly wire between where they're eating up in that corner and where these bales are. So they're not able to get to these bales as of yet. But I believe there's only one bale left up in the corner and that's going to be given to them today. So later on this week we'll be over here eating these ones. But it's been their normal routine. They hit the bale in the morning, in the evening. Usually first thing in the morning and midday, they're down here trying to find some green. Uh, just a full pasture graze. I don't have any partitions or any paddock set up. Pretty much give them access to where they want to go between this pasture and the one over where the hay is. So everybody looking good. Everybody's doing good. Um, a lot of people have concerns whether cattle will graze in snow. And this is just a light coating. But I've seen cattle push their nose down in six inches of snow to eat. We have no problem doing it. The problem is, is when we get a, a layer of ice, regardless how much snow we have. You could have two inches of snow, a crusty layer of ice on top, grazing stops. could have one inch of snow, crusty ice on top, grazing stops. Have six inches of snow with no crusty ice, cattle will graze. Some will rub, some will lick the snow off of rocks, and the others will just play. can obviously tell who's got their tummies full chewing their cud and standing around I got her eating the snow off that rock she has water I guess snows better but anyway I wanted to give a sneak peek into our first snow kind of talk about a little bit what's going on Not a whole lot going on here on the farm. I think it's 26 degrees this morning. Yesterday uh, was 19 when I was out here moving them bales. Um, kind of cold, but at the same time, I was very glad to see the frozen ground. We've had so much moisture, and it's been so warm that it's just been a muddy mess. Now, one big thing that's helped me out doing all these farm chores in the winter is my ATV cab. It's just a canvas cab. Bolts down with some U-clamps or U-bolts. And uh, it's really helped me out a lot. Keeps the wind off of me. Gives a place for the cows to hide. <laughs> and uh, it's made a huge difference. Now I usually leave this door open over here because I'm on and off so much. Here we go, Casey's got to rub on my poly stakes and rip them off the rack. Um, another thing I've done to my ATV is I added heated hand grips. I got a heated thumb lever. And all of that is a huge, huge help on these cold, cold mornings. So that's just a little bit of a farm update, folks. Um, I'm working to put together a 
a video of my morning chores. It's going to be kind of lengthy. Um, it's taking a lot of different camera angles and moving of the camera to get all this stuff done. You can see they just love my four-wheeler. She's moving me. But anyway, keep an eye open for it. It'll be coming soon. Thanks for watching, folks. Crazy Nakers Farms.